All right, so here we are with another episode of Minecraft. We are still in the process of trying to complete this Blaze farm. Um, I once, when I was doing a hardcore world, said that I loved fighting Blazes. They were my favorite after building this um, Blaze farm. I can say definitively, they're the worst. I don't like them anymore. I, I regret all of those statements. Granted, I also said that like in the next week, that's what killed one of my hardcore worlds. So I recognize that in that situation, I also regretted those words, but it really came back to, back at me when I was doing this. So I basically finished building up the box, obviously. The problem is, is that the way that blazes supposedly work is they have to move, if they move like four blocks from their original spawner, other blazes will spawn. And so the original design of this farm from the person that made it or whatever, wasn't set for an AFK farm. Um, anyways, so had to make those adjustments. I realized here that I had built it wrong, but forgot that there was lava above. And you see me here trying to like go, oh, you know, I should fix that. And then I realized my flame fire resistance had run out and I was about to lose everything to lava. And that took a lot to emotionally prepare for. <laughs> So we lost everything, um, except for my boots because my boots have netherite. I did eventually go get a new elytra. So yeah, we got the new elytra. And then I just bought a bunch of cheap stuff from all of my villagers. I'm not gonna make you guys sit through this. We've been through it enough. And I also know that it's going to happen to have, it's going to happen again later. So, so I won't, I won't make you guys sit through that. But anyways, so I basically just needed to shift the floor of my like AFK area down and I need to put these signs in. The signs were this part that I actually forgot last time. This is a part that, okay, we're back to ranting about blazes. I don't like the fact that they bump into you and it still hurts you. If I'm flame resistant, that means I should also be resistant to just blazes in general. I just think that that's just fair. That's how it should work. Um, but yeah, oh, it's such a pain trying to get these things so they would all go down in like the right thing but eventually I got it sort of working and um the original design of the de design anyways the original design of this had a piece of glass in between that area I have yet even now current present day player number two editing person has not yet bothered to put the piece of glass there. I just put a trap door there and called it good and I was like, yeah, it's good enough. After finishing that, I just wanted to do something relaxing. You know what? Let's go spend some time in our castle. <laughs> One of the more proud designs that I have. I decided to finally go and add a couple more of the um, lights kind of hanging from the ceiling because eventually I wanted to get it to the point to where I didn't need all of these torches around and I didn't have to worry about things spawning on it so that's sort of what I'm I'm doing here is just trying to fix the way um things are kind of set up so that they're done and now we're just gonna kind of wander around in it with all of its really cool lights I like having the beacon in the basement because I don't like having it kind of out everywhere. But my problem is with the fact, and I think it's cool the way it kind of sticks up, but my problem is is the fact that I had to put a hole in my roof. <laughs> and so that is my one bummer because beacons have to be able to see the sunlight and it's annoying. So yeah, so I, oh, I put in lights in all these different areas, which I think it looks really cool. You can see the glow, all the frog lights up at the, like the top area it's not quite finished yet we're still working on the glow on the frog lights it's close <laughs> i tell you one of these days we're gonna actually have it finished and we're gonna be like oh my goodness it's actually done but yeah so after i was finished wandering around looking at like this super pretty thing i went back to the process of upgrading all of my gear after losing it i did find that one guy in the sheep shearing thing i thought i had covered all of the spots but apparently i hadn't covered that one spot so unfortunately we had to had to rescue him from there and break a couple things but oh man that made me nervous just sitting here um but yeah so basically thankfully i have most of the guys all set up for getting all of the material that i need but yeah i don't know why they kept heading back into like the sheep area 
but yeah after um doing that i decided that i wanted a little bit more mud and i was okay so basically what happened was i afk'd and i didn't realize that i, I afk'd so i had to go in and make sure that all of my stuff was all my farms and stuff were working correctly and as you can see the other one wasn't working very well i found this guy out on the roof i don't know how he got out there he just randomly showed up and I don't quite know how to get him back and when I went back to go find him to try and find him I couldn't find him so yeah as you can see here I started the process of doing the long journey of covering this whole area with slabs this is like the kind of little area where I'm gonna get my wither skeletons obviously unfortunately I still have a bunch of other things spawning on it so I want to try and get some of the um, wither roses because I know that they wither skulls can only land or only spawn on top of those and so I want to make like a platform kind of area for them to only spawn on so I can go and get them but because I put a bunch of slabs on there which you'll see in a time lapse at the end of the video there aren't any wither skulls <laughs> spawning in my main fortress anymore so I had to fly across the way to this other one which isn't too bad as you can see I put the markers to keep them from chasing me but yeah so anyways let me know what you guys think down below and here is a time lapse of me placing down all of the slabs see you next time bye